Guys, I am me. I am me. Chef day. Welcome to my kitchen. Yeah. The number you have dialed. Hey guys, what is up? If you're new, welcome. If you're older but a goodie, welcome back. So today we're in at a kitchen. I don't know what the style is gonna be a thing on my channel now, I think. No, I'm not gonna me as the top chef. I am not a chef in no way, shape, or farm. Me and a somebody will brag to them can cook. Me never bless them where they know, girl. I can't try them, I can't feed myself, you know? So I just have practice because you know what I want. You know? Yeah, girls. Today I'm making one of my favorite, favorite, favorite and easy. Like, if you're hungry, I want something quick. You can steam some fish, cause steam fish take quick, quick, with no time for cook. So anyway, today I'm making steam fish and okra for all of the steam fish and okra by the girls. Them, my name too. Yes, good day. When I'm a steam fish and okra body. So we're gonna make some steam fish and okra, and I'm gonna side it with some broccoli. Steam fish and one of them thing they were like everybody make it differently. So even if me do something, you know, like me, I make it or me like it. Say so I can make it or you like it. You can take away from what I'm doing, add from what I'm doing is up to you. Um, but this is how I like mine. But anyway, guys, without further ado, let's get into it. I already cut up everything. I'm gonna show you what I'm working with and all of this, and let's get to our steam fish and okra body. There were two fish that we're gonna use. Nice and what I washed it already um with vinegar and some lemon i'm gonna show you what i'm working with so i got some pumpkin i got some carrots some thyme some green and red peppers okra the star of the show we got some pepper use this to your discretion i don't mind my fish being pepper so i use that so we got some garlic and some onion and i, I am gonna put some potatoes in there so i got them chilling right now in some cold water and then my seasoning is going to be very minimal. I'm just going to use this seasoning. I'm going to strain out the noodles in it. Because I am doing low carb slash keto. So the noodles in it is not keto friendly. So I'm going to strain those out. And then I'm going to use this Maggi fish seasoning. And a little bit of salt. I might not even use the salt just because this is very salty. But we're going to see. This is what we're working with. Now when it comes to steam fish, you can add what you want. It just depends what you like. You add it to it. But this is just what I'm going to use. I'm really not supposed to be using the potatoes. But you know, I'm going to try it. So I'm going to do it. Alright, so we're going to start off with the fish seasoning. I'm going to use about two tablespoons. I'm gonna use some of this fish tea um, mix. Just I'm gonna sieve it though because I don't want the noodles in it because I am doing low carb slash keto diet. But if you're not, feel free to just go ahead and throw it in there. This is like I need to break it up some, so I'm gonna use my finger and just like break it up. You want to be careful with your seasoning because you don't want your fish to be too salt. As for me, I don't like salt, so I'm not even going to use a lot of this. Just going to put some in it. Now let's see if it's salt. I'm not, when it go in the pot, I'm going like, to taste it and see if, it's, if it needs salt, I'll add it. But I'm not going to add it right now just because I feel like this is low-key. These seasons have a lot of sodium in it. All right, so for our fish, what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna take my fingers and, or you could take a spoon, however bougie you wanna be. So then, may I use my hand. Be careful though, just in case these parts of the fish will cut you. I'm telling you that based off of experience. And I just like feed the seasoning inside where I already cut. And just like lather it over the fish. First thing we're gonna do, we're gonna throw, um, add some water to our pot. And when it comes to measurement on them, some of the guys like, I mean, I'm not feel. We just go estimate. Can't was a real bad chef. Just estimate them cooking though. Yeah, good. Hey, that's your blade. And I'm gonna add, I'm gonna add the potatoes them to it. I'm gonna add the pumpkin to it. The reason I, I'm adding these first is because they are harder to cook. So once I put those in, I'm also gonna put some thyme in there. Um, so I'm also gonna add some thyme to it. 
I'm gonna cut a piece of the pepper put in there. I personally like when my steam fist have a little kick to it. So it's just up to you. And then I'm gonna add some butter to it. And I'm gonna let this cook. Like I said, this is hard. So it's gonna take some time. I'm gonna put a little bit more of this in there. Just to get one look of, you know, to get the water some flavor. So now I'm just gonna cover it up and let it sit. Make sure you turn it down. But right now my stove too high, so I'm gonna go turn it down some. Let it be there for about 10 minutes or so. Everybody does a look for me with Miss Team Fish and all covered it. All right, no, we're most ready now. Yeah, nice. Yeah, yes, perfect. Yeah. Okay, guys. So now, now we are gonna put in the fish. So we are gonna try to clear away. I have two fish. I'm not even know if the two. Let me see. I see good. I'm gonna pull them up a little bit more. Let me zoom out a little bit. So I have two fish, guys. I'm not even know if the two of them. I don't even know if the two of them are going to fit. I could try, I think. And the pot is kind of small now. We're not on a big pot. So, we're going to try still. I just have to move them here out the way a little bit. It's got, it got, it got tight in here, but... Not wrong. We clearly need a bigger pot, guys. Four falls. Throw up. It is alright. Once we close, once we close the pot, then we're alright. Guys, me need a bigger pot. Me fish them. Me fish them too big for the pot. But anyway, we still are gonna push through, you know, because we're not on other tries. So now I'm gonna go in with the onions. You know, now it's time to put in the onion. The onion they never need to go in first because um you don't want them to cook out too much, you know? So you just can't spread out your onion all over. Me love onion, you know, so me not mind all of this. I love it. And I'm going to drop the garlic in there too. I'm going to drop the garlic in there too. Yeah. I'm going to mince up the garlic already. So I'm just going to make sure say they're everywhere. Now I saw the pot here. Two small people, people. But it's alright. We are going to make it work. Because we are innovative. Alright. And then I'm going to go in with my rest of my time. I'm going to put that in. I'm also going to add the carrots to it. Alright, so I'm going to go back in now. I'm going to go this away. This are the star. I love when my, my fish nice and full of butter. Alright? So really with this, it's up to you, you know. But I'm going to put some more. Me love butter in my steam fish. So yeah. And then I'm gonna turn down the stove all the way down because as I'm telling you, you know, fish not fish don't take long for cook, but so I mean that's all covered up right to the pot not even want lock people for people. Listen, the tail the pot not even want lock on look. But it's alright, the tail don't eat. I'm gonna eat the tail. And guys, I know see some people put them okra last, but I'm not gonna put all of my okra in them. I just gonna put some of them in there. Just some. I know when okra cook and stuff, it's going to turn brown. But, I'm going to put a little bit. So now I'm going to go back with some more of the fish tea seasoning something. And I'm going to sieve some more in there. And guys, I swear on you sieve it if you're not on a diet. Like if you're not on a diet, the only reason I don't want to throw this in there is because these, these noodles are in there. And I'm doing keto and this is a lot of carbs. So... If not, you feel free, you can skip this step and just throw it out throw it in there, see it? So now I'm going to cover this down. So now I'm about to cover this down. Make that sick. No fish not take long for cook, like I tell you no. I can't tell you no say fish take 10-15 minutes to cook, I'm a door no. But I'm going to leave this for about 10 minutes. And then we're going to come back and see what I want in this. Alright y'all, so almost there so now i'm gonna go in and i'm gonna add the final stuff i'm gonna go in and add the pepper now a lot of people don't like pepper in them in them thing but you know honestly it's just up to you 
as me say, see if you show one of them things the way you, I feel like find out what you like and stick to it. So now I'm gonna add the okra. Alright. So we're almost there. Probably like one five more minutes and we reach. So because the pot here too small, I usually make one fish at a time. But they can't hardly see the fish, so I try push them around a corner so I can see. People, people, note to self, cook one fish. I usually cook one, but I just didn't want to um cook again tomorrow. But it's cool. We still have to achieve what we want to achieve. And I just like to check the water. Nice. It just looks nice. Once it has that buttery look to it. I'm going to just scoop up some, sprinkle it over. Yeah. I'm going to cover back this for about five minutes and then after that we'll come back. Alright guys, I think the boat land. I think the I think we reach. Nice. I just love this. I just love this sauce. This nice. So we're about to spread it on a plate and show them where we are working with. So guys, this is it. Um, I topped it off with some broccoli. I'm gonna eat it with broccoli. I really didn't need a broccoli because I have a lot of like, you know, food with it, but that's fine. Um, it looks really nice. I can't wait to dig in. This nice. Oh god, me never have a cook so. Yes, good. This nice bottom. Nice, 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 nice. Mm -hmm. Girl, mm -mm. nice and seasoned. Everything just properly, you know, salt, nothing like just nice. I'm a love pumpkin. We go taste the pumpkin. We won't taste the pumpkin. My girl, I look a taste test. Pumpkin, mm. nice and soft. Potato. Mm. Mm. Taste the peppers. You know the peppers look good. I love peppers. Mm -hmm. The broccoli. Me need some my juice. I need some my juice for the broccoli. Mm. All right, the okra. Mm. Now you could have added um, crackers if you wanted to. I'm not doing crackers because I'm doing low carb fast keto, so I'm not really gonna do that. But you could have went in and added crackers as well, but that's why I went in and added some broccoli. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next video. I'm gonna eat that this right now.